Victor Lustig's daring double sale of the Eiffel Tower. Victor Lustig, an infamous con artist, made his mark in the early 20th century by attempting to sell the Eiffel Tower twice, showcasing his ingenuity and cunning. In 1925, Lustig, posing as Count Victor Lustig, crafted a complex plot, convincing potential buyers that the Eiffel Tower was being dismantled and sold as scrap metal. With forged documents and persuasive rhetoric, Lustig exploited his target's greed and gullibility. His first attempt took place in Paris, where he succeeded in persuading a group of scrap metal dealers to make a hefty down payment for the landmark. The plot fell apart when the buyers realized they'd been tricked, but Lustig had disappeared by the time authorities got involved. Unfazed, Lustig returned to Paris for a second attempt to sell the Eiffel Tower. Although authorities were on alert due to his previous escapade, Lustig's audacious repeat of the same scam underscored his unwavering self-confidence. But Lustig's daring deeds extended beyond the Eiffel Tower. He used 47 different identities, carried many false passports, and lied his way through numerous other scams, ultimately making his way to Chicago to continue his deceit. Yet Lustig's legacy is shrouded in mystery and intrigue. His life's details remain obscured by his many aliases and deception-filled exploits. His audacious attempts to sell the Eiffel Tower twice remain a fascinating narrative in the history of cons and scams.